So uh, here is a quick tutorial how to make maps work. So we can go to San Francisco. And we can go to back to New York. Now uh, we can even type the specific um, addresses. We can write them on street. So that's New York Stock Exchange. So yeah, I was in New York. And Elizabeth, where is he? All right, so you've got the painting, right? So um, first of all, what you gotta do is you have to enable Google API keys. So here's a video from Bubble, how to set up Google API keys. I'm gonna be linking this video down in the description. Uh, so this is great tutorial about how to enable uh, APIs of Google. So once you do that, uh, you go to your editor. So I'm gonna, Start the new one, places tutorial. So, uh, first you need to get the search box. Now, once you get the search box, placeholder can be anything like start typing, uh, geographic places, and that's it. So, just because you have um, uh, Google Places API enabled, this search is going to work. So, Let's say New York, and it generates the options. So now what you're going to do is you're going to introduce the map here. So we're doing the map. Here it is. All right. So um, I want to display the uh, single pin, right? So marker address. I don't know what that means. Oh no, that's the data. So I want to get the search box A's value. And I guess that should be it. We're done. So you move there into preview. And I want, let's say, London, UK. Boom. You got it. Probably you can display the list as well, but you're going to need to uh, get those data into the database and then you should uh, link this map to the database so if that's what you need just comment down below and I'm gonna do a tutorial on that one as well